You guys, I have some goodies to show you from FG Normal. Yes, they sent me a few things to show you guys, and I'm really, really excited. We have four specials, and these ones are insane. Like, the detail, wait till you see them. Hey everyone, it's Marina from Diamond Painting with the Besties. I hope you're doing all well. I hope your week is going well. Um, if you're new and you have never heard of FG Normal, they are a budget-friendly site that offers diamond painting, diamond painting um, off-canvas projects, cross-stitch, um, accessories and things like that. Um, they reached out to me and they were so kind as to have me pick out a few things. And so I'm going to share them with you today. So like I said, we have four specials. Now these are probably the most in-depth specials I have. There is so much going on and so much detail, like as far as the drill placement. And I'm really, really excited. So um, I also want to say I am sorry that they're not completely flattened, but I got them in the mail and I just had to show them off. So, and the sun is shining. It's like one of those cloudy, then not cloudy days. So this first one we have is a 30 by 30. It is a partial, even though there is so much going on and there are so many diamonds. This, this bee within all of these flowers, um, you know, in real life, I don't, I mean, I like bees because what they do for like the earth and crap, but not like when they buzz around me. Cause I feel like they got all this airspace. I don't need to, need to. I need to know why they need to be up on my business. But anyway, there is a legend over here and a legend over there. No thumbnail, but here is the kit number on here. There are nine special shapes and colors in this one. So let us take a look. Um, let me find them. Oh my goodness. No, oh, here we go. So let's see what kind of specials are in there. And let's keep our fingers crossed that we have no little slivers because they are not... The video. Like, I am not a fan of the slivers at all. So, what do we have? And you guys know there will be a finish at the end, so don't worry. Um, we have some half gold balls here. We have these really pretty iridescent faceted marquees. You can see the green and pink and blue in here. We have some round, uh, some smooth pink marquees. We have some faceted blue marquees. We have some yellow crystal. We have some black regular drills. We have some pink crystals, some light blue, some like citrony kind of yellowy green. We have or yellow. Actually, these are probably more yellowy. And we have two bags of those. So that's everything that you need. So now I'm I'm going to make a prediction and probably say that these ones I'm showing you are probably going to take a little more time just because of everything going on in them. But here is the first one. So that really nice B, I think it's going to be amazing. This next one, I absolutely loved it when I saw it and threw it right in the cart. I'm loving the colored background, the gold with the brown, a little bit of an ombre effect going. 30 by 30 partial. There are six special shapes and colors in this one. This swan with all these seashells, it looks like. And here, this must be an oyster. Now, I wish this pearl, these pearls right here would have been like right in here, those would have been like big, huge pearls. That would have been awesome. But it is still very gorgeous. Um, I can't wait to see what this looks like. Let me find the drills for it. This one I already, we already looked at. Is this it? No. No, that's not it. Goodness. Why here it is, right here. I didn't think this was it at first, but this is it. It looked kind of small for all of the detail going on. So let's take a peek. So right off the bat, we do have two packages of this gold crystal. We have this kind of grayish, smoky crystal. We have these um, ear AB red teardrops. We have these faceted iridescent rounds. We have faceted uh, yellow marquee. And then we have some faceted smaller yellow rounds. It looks like there's way more going on in here, but um, really these are all of the rhinestones. There's just like a lot of them, but I think this one is going to be so stunning when complete. Um, this one I think is going to take quite some time as well. 
Now we're moving on. The next one is a 30 by 40. Sorry that it is wrinkled, but you guys, I love anything with an anchor on it. And I loved this teal background. So we have an anchor with all of these flowers right here. It's like I said, it is a 30 by 40. There are nine special shapes and colors. We do have a, a uh, thumbnail here. And then we have the two legends. Um, and let's see what our drills look like. This pack of drills seems bigger, but it doesn't seem as there's many on here, but I am excited. And I don't really have anything quite like this. Oh, I forgot to show you that every, every kit you get comes with a basic toolkit. So a boat, pen, and wax. All right, so we've got two bags of green crystal. We have orange crystal. We have a darker orange. We have red. We have clear. We have like a brown, kind of like a goldish brown. Uh, we have this light blue. And then we have two bags of, are they the same? Yeah, two bags of these smooth round pearls. And then we have these smooth orange teardrops right here. So I can tell you, I know right here, these hat, these round, these red rounds right here are gonna go where all these eights are. So that's gonna look and up here in the flower. So that's gonna be pretty awesome. Um, there's like a lot of swirling action going on. So there might be a lot of single placing taking place right here. So we might not be able to really get um You know, you might not really be able to do too much with a multi-placer, four probably at most, but we do have these straight lines here, so hopefully that'll make up for it. All right, you guys, now this next one, I'm going to have to pan over. It is absolutely huge. I'm going to try and raise you up a little bit. This is a 40 by 70. Check this out. This owl, like I don't know where I'm going to put it or do with it afterwards, but I just knew that I wanted it. It is a 70 by 30. It's a partial. So all this background doesn't get done. This one definitely will have to rest for a little bit. There are 17 special shapes and colors in here. And basically you're just doing the flowers with the owls, with the owl on here. And um, his eyes don't get done. Um, I'm not quite sure what this is in the background, but it is pretty cool. Are we ready to see the drills? <clears throat> so I'm trying to decide which one I want to do because you guys know I like having finishes for you. Kind of gives you a better idea of what it's going to look like afterwards. Um, I'm going to tell you, I don't know, maybe it will be this one. I'm not quite sure. Anyway, what are we starting off with? We have faceted red oval. I've never had that before, so that's cool. We have some faceted um, oval in pink. We have some iridescent blue shard, yellow shards. We have these gold um, textured or faceted marquee. We have faceted yellow marquee. We have faceted iridescent clear marquee with that pinks and purple. We have a smaller faceted marquee, pinks and purple. We have faceted light blue. We have this light purple crystal, blue, uh, light blue, medium blue, a pinkish red, orange, yellow, and then a fuchsia. So, so much going on here. I'm not quite sure which one to do because you guys, there is, it looks like lots of opportunity to use a multi-placer, but there's just so many different colors. But I promise that I will definitely have a finish for you. So please stay tuned to the next clip. Again, thank you FG Normal for sending these out to me. And you guys, uh, make sure you stay tuned so you can see a finish. All right, see you in the next clip. Hey everyone, I am back and I have a finish from you from one of the kits I received from FG Normal. Now, um, before I get into it, I do wanna say um, I was going to do the Bumblebee for you guys. There was zero glue. Zero. Now, I, yes, I probably should have checked it, and I'm going to start doing that um, with some of these partials <laughs> moving forward, um, but I've never had an issue before. The only glue that was on there was the um, 
in, where the larger gems were, but it seemed like everywhere else that there was supposed to be a symbol, um, there was no glue. So I was kind of bummed about that. I really wanted to do the bee. So next best thing I did was the swan. Now, I want to start off by saying um, it came out absolutely beautiful. This took forever. It did. It took absolutely forever. Um, I don't know if it was the colors, the background, you know, a lot of browns. Um, I'm not quite sure what it was, but this took me a very long time. I also want to point out in two spots again, here and then here, on those number one symbols, there's no glue. Now, could I have done it myself and added some glue? Yeah, I don't have the right glue for that. And, you know, I do have clear glue, but I wasn't going to go through all that for two drills. I wasn't. But you can do that if you choose and if it does happen to you. But hopefully it wouldn't because out of like going on my fourth year of diamond painting, um, this is the first time this has ever happened. So, um I'm not really, really worried about it. But this did have six special shapes and colors in it. Um, I absolutely love the finished look. I did not enjoy working on it. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. Um, I did not have fun. Not even placing these. When I, I saved these faceted marquees for last and was just finally like, oh my God, can I please be done? Um, yeah. But anyway... The final product, like I said, is beautiful. Um, I do want to give a huge thanks again, FG Normal, for sending these out to me. You guys, all the kits will be linked below if you choose to want to make a purchase for yourself. Other than that, you guys, um, I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day, and I will see you in the next video. Remember, be safe and be kind. Bye.